Hello Space Engineers, Future Wellington 6012 here, how you doing? Hope you're good? So yeah, possibly, probably, maybe a little bit of a bonus episode here, we'll just see how things go. Uh, got a little bit of a mess to clean up. Uh, so up there somewhere is the the Martian Gateway that's headed to Mars. I just looked at the NT list before, it's about like 80 k's away or something, so it's, it's plotting away. Uh, yeah, I just, uh, yeah, let's uh, change the camera and I'll tell you what I'm doing. Um, so yeah, I was just mine came over here to mine a little bit of iron. We got the got the trailer over there, and we've got the the rover thing down in here. And uh, yeah, I was just doing it uh, off camera just before I got into a little bit of Aries Col uh, Aries at War streaming. And uh, yeah, had a little bit of an accident, and this is upside down so what happened was i um i went to put the thing in the hole the the drill and extend it and the whole thing sort of clanged out vibrated and ended up in there <laughs> so uh yeah it was an attack of clang uh and then i was like well i haven't Inventory really thing. got time to sort this out i'll just take this up because we do need some wine uh i haven't really got time to sort this out and yeah so the man in the red suit said we'll let future wellington deal with that here I am, dealing with it. So, uh, yeah, and I just thought it's not going to sort of fit into the main, uh, the main line of, of, uh, the, the series. Um, but I thought, well, we'll just, we'll just record and see what happens as I'm doing it. And yeah, it might make a sort of half episode. Why not? Um, because, yeah, I think we're going to have to change how this kind of works a little bit. So, uh, first of all, we need to get this out of the hole. Um, and how I'm going to do that is actually start to make a little bit of a uh, temporary drilling thing. Is that the right word? Uh, collector type thing. So, and yeah, so I've got a bit of an idea. First, I need to get this out of the hole though. Uh, but what I will do is I will uh, use this to make some stuff uh, yeah and as I said, I'm just going to record this and if it works out it works out if not if not, it won't so I'll put you there and then I want a hinge 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 on there like that we will oh don't fall down didn't want you to fall down okay we'll come back to that so we'll have to roll that up haven't got parts for it obviously the only parts i've got that are out of an unknown signal uh what else am i going to need okay well we could actually probably put some of these parts on like i think i want that Actually, no, we'll just, we'll, oh, yeah, I'll put that on now. Oh, gosh, that didn't work. Okay, let's just sort this out. Get those parts, and then we need a rotor, I think. So, a rotor to get it up back up on its wheels, basically. So, let's grab all those bits and pieces. Like so. Uh, into the production list. I was just making some stuff. Hopefully it'll work. Um, yeah, just need to put those ahead of the queue, I think. Get some more of them, some more of them. Uh, right, and I'll grab some more of that out, some of that out. That should do the trick. Really? So slow. Okay, nearly, 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 nearly. Oh, I should have brought some more iron up with me when I came back up. You might. Okay, that should be everything now. Yes. 
Down we go. Yeah, so I've got a little bit of time today to uh, to do this. And yeah, not to make a full episode though. So I thought, well, we'll just do this and then we can play a full episode by ear. Which will probably be tomorrow for me. Um, it's just, yeah, a little bit busy at the moment doing things. Uh, and I did do two streams of uh, Heroes at War, so, you know, that's... Uh, just turn that up and put the lock on. Cool, cool. Okay, so that's good. Well, um, that's fine. So now I want to put a rotor on, and this will just be temporary. Uh, we'll go with one of those. And then... Oh, what happened to the... Hmm, strange. Uh, right, let's just go like... That and that. Then we don't even... Oh, don't spin! Oh, okay. So we need to make that up. Um, let's just attach... Uh, yeah, so one of them, right click, right click, and a landing gear, magnetic plate. Right click. So I think that should be enough. Take some of these up with us. Oh, whose silly idea was it to put those women all that iron all the way down there? <laughs> okay, more motors. Urgh. Okay, they're coming. They are coming. I'll put some more in there as well. Okay, we'll go back to that in a second. So I think that's the, yes it is. Uh, sure, oh three Ks is a bit far. Two motors. One. Two. Three. So what I'm, oh, I didn't want to make that, reattach it. And we'll lock that as well. So what I'm intending to do is lift this up by that end and then rotate it around. So yeah, it's going to take a bit of lifting. So if we put one of them on and then one of them, so I might even have to do it in like two goes. Hopefully that fits in there. Oh, it just doesn't quite fit. Okay, uh, that's fine. We can rotate you around. It's only the collision box that didn't fit. and then one of one of those like that so weld that one up weld that one up weld that one up it's clang-tastic okay so now we can rotate that back into place maybe 
just back that way so it's back up to zero degrees perfect rattle up that okay so that's locked yeah so i'm gonna reuse this this bit here once i'm done okay so uh actually i want to tilt this first and go like that that's good so then when i get it up it'll be a little bit straighter okay so lifting this Let's just do that and turn up the energies. Uh, I might just copy all that and I'll paste it in that one. It should work better. Okay, and it's not lifting. It's bending is what it's doing. So, oops, wrong one. That didn't really make any difference. Okay, that's fine. Let's twist this up the other way. Hinge locks on. Oh, gosh. So, hmm, it's just not coming out of the hole. Okay, what we might need to do is put a jack in here. Um... Can I lift it up? Yeah, these just aren't handling it. So, what we might need to do is... Yeah, just put one... Put one on this end. Like so, maybe. So if I just came right up like that, came out like that, then there, uh, that like that. Doesn't quite fit because of the okay that should be sufficient okay and can we put like a wheel or something on the end of it Oh, because it's probably in the way of the, um, oh no, there we go. Okay, so let's go like that. What could possibly go wrong? Uh, yeah, let's go. work just for a little bit of uh, stuff ok 
Okay. Okay, so far so good. Hmm, okay. Oh, that's not looking for super flesh. Uh, can we just reduce that a little bit? Push that one up a little bit now. Playing tastic. <laughs> okay, um, so I was sort of going to rotate it, but I'm just not liking <laughs> that idea much at all. I think we go for plan, different plan to uh, get something for it to lie down on. Okay, I think that's going to be uh, a wiser course of action. Okay, so gentle, gentle. Oops. Okay. Uh fine I think I think we just cut this and hope I think that was a good a good result right so that's fine uh, these are not required anymore so we will break them down because now we can do a sort of different way of rolling over No worries. I wasn't concerned. Okay, well, it's out of the hole. So that's that. Um, so now rolling it over, let's just put some blocks in there like that, get a little bit of leverage. Like so. Uh, actually, hang on, what we'll do is we'll do that. And we will go like that and like that. Enough. 
wondering why that was like that, because it was the other one. Get in there, and over it goes. Okay, uh, let's just reverse that. So normally I would do this just with batteries uh, or something like that, something nice and heavy and try and um, just change the old uh, come on, roll roll, okay that's not working, I think we need to change this yeah normally I try and just use a bit of uh, mass it's not working today. Ah, because I haven't got room in here, which is the problem. Okay, so let's go out here like this. Again, that's a thing. Whoa! Slipped off. Steel. What? Really? Uh, okay, well that one's surplus to requirements now that it fell off. I don't think we'll be falling off this one. Thank goodness I got a jetpack, that's for sure. This would be a little bit tricky without it. Come on. Okay, what I might do is so it doesn't slip. Can I put a half block in there? Yes, I can. Let's do that. Hopefully this push should get it over. So, welcome to the world of future Wellington. <laughs> that guy in the red suit just does stuff and then expects me to fix it. <laughs> oh. This is the sort of stuff. 
Illy, illy, nearly. Oh, really? Really? So close. Are you in the... No, you're just on the wrong side. Ugh, okay. Gonna run out of steel in a sec. But yeah, we might have enough. That one, that one. Lovely. We're just about there, surely. And there it goes. And it's normally at this point in the YouTube video that it rolls over the other side of a bank and uh, yeah, anyway. Okay, so that's that. Let's get this out of here. Energy low. So I didn't want to sort of make anything permanent down here, but um I do have a little bit of a plan. Oh, whoops. Which was not to uh, grind off that access point. Okay, we better just put that back on. I'm still amazed, actually, at this this vehicle. It was never meant to be anything, you know? It's just how it's evolved. It's not. This isn't the only playthrough where it's just evolved. I know that um, Uncle Jay's done quite a bit of work with his one. Uh, and same with Millman. Uh, yeah, it was never intended. It was only ever a prop. I never built it to actually be used like it's been used. So, um, yeah. It's a little truck that could. Okay, so that's that. Right. Uh, let's get rid of that rotor. So what I thought was that um, we could use this so we'll lock it and what I was thinking was we we'll probably only need like a block. Then one of those, I think, would be the way to go. Just locked itself. Let's uh, switch the lock on that. Oh, what a lock off. Okay. So then the other thing that I'll do is I'll put some lights on, because lights is a thing. Uh, just like that. Oh gosh, we left that there. And, that. and so they will be on, off there, off there, and I'll make them quite large. So, uh, let's just put a button on there. And that will be to switch lock on this. Like so. Okay, so now... Yeah, I'll just leave the button on there. I think that'll be the way to go. Uh, hang on, let's just get out of this. Energy low. Let's just tilt you up. Okay, so that maximum is going to want to be that. Minimum. Maximum? Minimum. Uh, why are we not? Oh, I bet you that just fell off, didn't it? Nuts. <laughs> Uh, 
Use for parking off. Use for parking off. Okay, that's annoying. Uh, hmm. Okay, now what? It's going to jiggle its way into the hole as what? Um. Ugh. Okay, well, I guess we've just got to put a small battery on it. Let's just stop it before it goes into the hole, shall we? Uh, put a small battery on, or... Yeah, we'll just put a small battery on it. So need some parts for that. Things are going awesome. Gateway will be to Mars by now. <laughs> uh, where is it? It is... Three hundred k's away, ninety-seven meters a second it was good, because it was going a little bit slow earlier. But anyway, oh, I could no. Hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. We don't need to use that. We could just use the bike and lift it. Uh, just need to unlock. We'll just take this down the tunnel. It'll be fine. We can use it. I'm sure we'll be able to lift. Lift that little thing. Just need to be careful not going too fast because there's not really any way to. Whoa! Turn. Yeah, not. It wasn't the brightest idea to bring this. Well, I mean, it was a good idea to bring this down here, but the realities of flying this bike in this tunnel are too uh, slightly different. Okay. that's there right oh. piece of cake There's out, there's out. I think going up will be a bit better than going in. Yeah, this is a scary place to <laughs> to ride this bike. Oh gosh. Oh what she had. Oh gosh. Back that's good. Back into Whoops. Sweet, sweet room. It's awesome. Okay, I've uh, probably still got. No, it's fine. Okay, right. Where were we? Stuck in a hole is where we were. Hmm, maybe that's going to be the name of the episode. Stuck in a hole. Because <laughs> we're just going to get out of here. Okay, so now let's move this into place. Spin it around, spin it around. We'll 
we'll just go up in this tunnel here a little bit. Okay, and then back into there. Right, so we haven't got super amounts of room. So what my thought was is that this could then rotate down. So we could move it around with this thing. Um, yeah, it would kind of need to go along the side of it probably. Yeah, I don't really want to actually... So that's down like that. That's fine, that's fine. What we'll do is we might even put like a high ab type um, setup on it or something that could actually work. Yeah, let's bring this forward a little bit. Um, there we go, that's what we want. Because now that can lock. Okay, so then let's go for a hinge like that. Who's that texting me? Uh, so we went like that. Okay, we'll have to go and grab that stuff. What do they need? Large steel tube, large steel tube. Okay, so we need to get some large steel tubes, is what we need to do. Ooh. Ow, 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 ow. It's fine. Everybody's fine. those ones and we'll make some more. See when the flying goes quite well in here it goes quite well but you only need to make a glancing blow on something and you end up ricocheting across the place. Right, uh, I should actually power this because then it will be a powered grid and it won't despawn on me. Now that I think about it need to be charged or anything. Okay, so that's that. Uh, yeah, and then we'll put another one under there. Did I... That. Can't place it. Why can't I place it? Surely I should place that. Yeah. Oh. Yeah, to get all of that. Okay, that's fine. Okay, so we'll lift you up. Let's just put another one on there and then probably one of those on there. Is that what I want? Yeah, and then another another hinge. Uh, like that. Okay. 
Okay, and then we'll reverse that down to there. Let's make it only five max. Should be fine. And then what? What? And uh, yeah, then I think I'll just put the drill on top of there. Should be fine. Fuel low. Oh. Fuel critical. That could be annoying. I hope I've got some fuel on board here. I wasn't worried. Is everything? Really? Got everything? Awesome. Didn't get everything. Thought I might have missed one of those. It's a little bit annoying. You might. Uh, let's just hiff that into there so we know it's there for next time. Ow. Ow, 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 ow. Ow. <laughs> ow. <laughs> just two. Oh, you know what I haven't done while I was over here? Something that I need to do. How's the fishies? Fishies okay? Good. Okay, so now we should be right. Is that one there, wasn't it? No wonder I missed it. I can't even get to it. It's got it. Okay, so now hopefully we should be able to uh, sort that out. Um, uh, hinges. Pistons. Okay, so now hopefully this is in such a way that we can actually move it around if we need to. Some way, somehow. I mean, that almost wants to actually duck underneath, but anyway, let's not worry about that right now. Let's just use it here. Uh, so we will reverse you down like that, I think. Should be sufficient. Put the hinge lock on. And then this one will reverse over that way. Cool. And we'll put the hinge lock on as well, just because. And then turn you on. And because we're locked down, that's not going to really cause too many things. And plus, we've also got our ejectors all the way over there, which is good. So now we can move you into the hole. Like so. Whoops. Don't 
See, that's why I don't right click. That's why I don't right click to get out of it. Okay, and then we'll keep going down. And then this one will do the same thing. Left click to confirm, right click to exit. See, I have to actually make a bit of effort to do that. Then that should be going deeper. So we might just need to squid you down a little bit. We can. Oh, it's a bit quick. Did the job though. Yep. Uh, so that's fully extended. We will lock you. I say nuts I mean whoops that was my fault being too impatient and now I'm gonna have to build another one can't place the drill Ugh. you're okay still uh, oh well, with the ejecting stone we know that works Back we go. So yeah, the intention's not to make that drill collection thing um, super transportable. It's just designed in such a way that I can move it. It's not going to be easy. It's going to be quite cumbersome. Um, but uh, yeah, I can move it if I need to. Is, uh, is the plan with that. But yeah, it's not for hooking on the back and driving... 15 kilometers back to the depot or anything like that okay so that was just because I went too quick and because we've got grids so that's all right by itself yeah point point one's about the maximum obviously so when that was going point one as well that made it point two so this is working through the stone I take it why is there so much ice in here hmm we've got some of it in here oh I know why because it ran flat that's why <laughs> so I had to recharge it that's right it was a little while ago okay let's just do some hand mining here just to open this up a little bit as well get the iron that's here. So that is yeah it's not as deep as that one. So what we might just need to do is, just while we're here today, oh, I don't have the steel on me, do I? Nope. Okay, we might just need to put in a little thing. Either that or we just move it. Make it a squidge deeper. Can we do that? Uh, minus point zero five. It's going the wrong way. Get ready with the lock. I'm 
do. Yeah, so it's not too bad. So we might just need to put a little bit of a... A little bit of steel across here just to make sure stuff does go correct to the correct place. Just because that hole's a bit too deep. Okay, let's just go grab some steel. Uh, what did I put? I thought I put that back. Oh, I did put that back in there. It's still on me. So I don't, definitely don't have any. Oh, I could use these. Use these. So they'll probably despawn when I sort of go away a bit. That'll be sufficient. Right. Uh, turn the... No. No. Battery. Battery. What can I get the battery? Ugh. Battery, auto. Uh, why am I? Oh, because I'm crashed. Why am I not going fast? I'm walking. Um, right. So, uh, antenna on. Uh, we'll dial that back. We don't need that high. And jump into the micro minor control. Uh, we go around like this from the truck view. Okay. Yeah, there we go. Right. Uh, actually, I might just change the view on that. So let's go into uh, the micro. The micro minor. Let's just do it, the F9 camera like this, I think. F9. And we can change it to this one if need be. Continue on. Um, yeah. I don't know when it's going to full. Have to keep an eye on it. So yeah. Oh, well, we'll just keep doing this. So that's so good. It's working. system works okay let's just get out of that for a sec so one's really full so I'll tell you what what we want is probably an event controller Actually, we're using build vision for everything else. Let's get rid of that. Let's put the event controller in here. Computers. Oh, there we go again. So slow is it? So yeah, that's it. I want to accidentally hit walk. Not sure. 
have to get a computer, didn't I? Yes. And I have... No. Need to get some things for a light. that light hmm. okay so no, I'll put one on okay we'll make that red Turn that off. Okay, and then the light and the drill want to be in a group. Drill control, we'll call it. And then the event controller we want to cargo field select actions drill control oh. hmm. okay let's not do drill control let's just do the light So when it's full, toggle it on. When it's empty, toggle it off. And greater than 75%. And we're going to use that drill there. So now, when that drill gets filled up, that should turn on. And we should be able to see that. Okay. Uh, seem to be not be collecting stuff down there. That's fine. Control again. Go to F9. Go to F8 and just make sure things are working. F9. go. Try and move a little bit. I do like this little miner. It's awesome. I've said it numerous times during this series but, and it's not really a, actually that applicable in this situation, although I have made it. Doing the remote control thing really has uh, improved my abilities a great deal. It's been really quite a cool scenario. This just to really sort of extend and get some new skills in this game that I've been playing for many thousands of hours. And uh, yeah, it's just, it's always a learning thing, eh? It's just crazy. Surely that should. Whoa, 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 whoa. Surely we must be full by now. Am I just being impatient? Full, full, full. Okay, why did the light not turn on? Hmm. Strange. Okay, maybe that event controller didn't work. Event controller. Where is it? Event controller. 
Pretty sure 75 drill too. Oh, it's only at 20%. That's why. Maybe it was just a bit of random timing that I just happened to do it then. Uh, is that what I want to do? I think I went into the wrong one there. Micro miner. Just to get that so that they fall in. That's cool. Okay, well that's um that's worked. Yeah. Uh right. So and yeah, it's just it's only 20% full, that's why. <laughs> so I don't know what the story was there. Right, this is gonna be heavy. Uh let's jump into here. Unlock that. And Try and get out the hole. Ooh, that time. Yeah, got it that time. Where we go? Slow it down a little bit. Awesome. The system works. So, uh, yeah, we'll just uh, continue on with this. I'm not going to edit this episode. It's just going to be, uh, it's just going to be others. I think I'm, now that I'm at this stage, I'm an hour in. And, yeah, I will, will keep the episode. I'm just going to keep it as is. Be on Future Wellington's channel. And, uh, yeah, we'll, um, we'll get another load of this. And then I'll drive it back to the main base. And, uh, we'll call it a day there. So, that's, that's the plan. So, I just need to take this back up and connect it to the trailer. Um, but yeah, I think that's been a success, and that will that will deal with the night as well. So I'll get this sorted, and no, let's not go that way. Let's go this way. Make sure that we don't crash into anything. Just around the back of the around the back of here is the best way to go, I find. Uh, I'm not going to repair the drill on this. I think we passed that now. And which way is that? Okay, so that's good. Just need to back up to it. Perfect. Oh, I could have stayed in there and done that. Right, so, brakes. Uh, right, so, if we go into that one there, then that's my tra Okay, there we go. So, we'll transfer that over, that over, that over, that over, that, that. Okay, uh, can I put any of that in my inventory? No, I can't it's not connected so what I'll do is let's just take that put it in there let's just put our two bottles in there and then fill it up okay that's taken all of it that's good that's what we wanted lift this into here and away we go. Right, easy peasy. So that's good. Let's head back down again. And then next time we need to... Yeah, it's pointed the other way, so that's fine. Oh, I don't think we're quite going to make it. Not if that... Oh, maybe, 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 maybe. Never doubted it. Never doubted it. We were always going to make that. Uh, now, I am missing some lights off here as well. Um, no, I'm not. Hmm. Oh, I know where it came from. 
Um, came off the drill. The drill had a light on it. That's right. I was just, I remember there was a light sitting on the ground. I ground it up after the, the little incident with the drill arm. And uh, yeah, that's, that's, uh, yeah. Uh, now I'll take my hover bike back with me as well. I'll just attach it to the roof of this thing. Yeah, so I want to do that as well. Okay, so let's just spin around in here. Whoa. So this was, I guess, just a bit of a proof of concept today, because I can't imagine that I'm actually going to sort of take it out of the hole. Sorry, I'm just doing this the wrong way. I keep, oh gosh. Just can't quite see. I can back a vehicle, I'm just not, because I'm doing it with the camera backwards. There we go. Okay. No, don't need to do that. I can control it from here. It's just a habit of getting out. Okay. That's good. Uh, oh, hang on. Need to turn the drills on. Drill. No, 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 no. Back out. No. Down there. Okay. Drill on good and then uh, then into the micro mine control so it would just be good to tidy up some of this stuff here like so just get some of that turn that off and let's just do the Thing like that just so we can see a little bit better so now if I go into F9 yeah I might just go and that bit there's a bit low turn that up so we can see Cool, okay, that's good. Right, call it again. Yeah, now I can see in there, that's good. And of course, as we know, uh, I'm using the camera, but there's nothing to stop me setting up a portable camera uh, with like a drone or something, you know, like I could put the, I could just park the hover bike here. Oh no, there's gonna be an antenna. But uh, yeah, I'm not too worried about using this camera and the, the spectator cam in this sort of circumstance, because yeah, as I say, I can quite easily just build a drone uh, and a little observation drone drone, and yeah, look through the camera on that uh, or even just attach one to a wall in here somewhere, so so as I say, I feel like I'm not cheating because I the game mechanic of Space Engineers does allow you to look through other cameras so then it becomes a thing of, well, if you can do it and you've proven that you can do it, do you actually need to do it for the sake of doing it for the sake of doing it when actually, yeah, you don't want to muck around, you don't want to waste time. Okay, but that's all good. No, this is working well. I think not having that, it, it, having a thing to just dock into makes life a bit easier. I mean, you know me, I like my drill machines with ejectors and then a separate collector. That's my sort of preference on doing things. Sick. Go into here, so that one's ok, 
Okay, so we're, we're getting there. We're almost there. Yes, I can't see much in this one. Let's just about be there. So I think from memory, last time I took two loads over with all the yield modules on the refineries back at the main base. Oh, there we go. There we go. That worked. That worked. It's all gone red. Um, yeah, when I put the refineries on the base last time. Uh, let's just... Where is this? Uh, the, when I refined... Oh, let's start that again. When I took a truck and trailer unit full of... Um, so I just re put that on recharge. When I put a full truck and trailer unit on to uh, for refining with all those yield modules, I think I got about a hundred k, if not more, out of it. Let's just unlock like that, and then we go like this, and then like that. And we are out, and we are headed out of the tunnel. We're going to hook the trailer up, and we'll take that back, and we will call it a day. And that'll be just right, actually, because, yeah, I've sort of got some other things to do today. So, I've only got really tomorrow to actually record the next episode before it's due to release so so it may be that this is the only episode this week during the week but we'll just see what happens so i don't think it's super super fantastically awesome for the main storyline as it were so quite happy for it just to be a, a bonus episode Now I've seen a, more than a couple of other people's bases in regards to uh, playing the scenario, whether it's through through YouTube series or through just pictures in Discord, and pretty much I think everybody has used this as their main base. You know, um, I've I made the choice to go to the lake. It's just uh, yeah, it's nice to see that other people doing this scenario are just doing it completely different from how. I did it which I guess is just a good an indication of what a good scenario it is actually um, that you can still very much make it your own scenario uh, if I was to do things again I might do things even differently let's make up there There we go, okay, so that's that. And if we go into here, I think I can attach. Ooh, I think that's going to be the attach button. No, okay, that's not. Oh no, that's the one from the drills. Uh, we don't have those drills anymore. So, not that one. That one, okay. So, that's either attach or detach. Yes, that's attach. Turn that back on. And those are probably hinge locks on. And then I think that we are probably good to go. I do believe we are. So if I look on the side there, yeah, Fizzies is on. Okay, a little bit of night driving back to the main base, but that's, uh, oh, that's good. Oh, hang on, I didn't grab the bike. Didn't grab the bike. We'll take that back with us as well. Because it doesn't have an antenna, I can't remote it back. Uh, that's there. Cool bike, this. The, the bike is certainly... 
out of this series. I mean, I always get my, my, my favourite vehicles. And certainly in this series has added some to the list. My bike. I like my bike. Um, so that's real cool. This, uh, this Rover, uh, I'm not emotionally attached to it at all. <laughs> I think it's quite similar to the one that I had on Escaping the Desert. And that, that was a cool one. Um, I think as far as Rovers go, still the my Mars Explorer, the one I had on Mars, is probably my favourite. Um, this one. Um, so I'm just trying to, trying to get this down. Has that got a locking thing on it? Yes, okay, turn them off. Okay. So we can tow that back. Uh, yep, yeah, so, oh, set now, that is just really in the way. Okay, no, we might have to, we might have to redo that, that's not going to work. Uh, turn that on, disconnect, we might just need to put it on the back trailer, I think. Let's do that. Yep, yeah, so, not emotionally attached at all to this, uh, this rover. It's uh, it's so similar to the one on Escaping the Desert that it's very similar. Um, but the bike, love the bike, and uh, my red rocket ship. So those are the two big ones for here. I mean, the Marama rocket on Hyphestus Prime was pretty cool um, for getting into orbit, but I think I think my red rocket ship is certainly uh, more and more and more favourite of mine. Um, yeah, and I've got some favourites, of course, on my other series, but for this series, yep, so far, it is the, because uh, everything else is sort of functional, uh, you know, it's sort of functional things made for certain reasons, but uh, yeah, no, I'm liking, I'm liking my bike, and I like my red rocket ship. The miners, yeah, the little micro miner's pretty cool. The mini miner, yeah is what it is you know i like them all but you know you get favorites yeah you know for instance drones when it comes to drones still my favorite drone the one i miss the most is the grapefruit that was from high Festus prime so yeah that was cool the grapefruit and the cent centipede was pretty cool um very useful and uh, I never really flew it that much. Um, certainly the, the Never Surrender, the shuttle that I had, that was cool. Yeah, that was real awesome with the VTOL thrusters. So anyway, reminiscing. Uh, let's just head back to the base. It shouldn't take long. It should only take five, five or ten minutes. And uh, yeah, I'm going to pull the pin there. And hopefully morning won't be far away for the next episode. Which will be uh, seeing how the gateway's going, and so I might just need to up up the speed and up the power a bit. Uh, is that strength? Hopefully, I can climb up this hill. Uh, yeah, so, and I'm going to build a sort of a scout type rover thing. So it's going to be sort of, a, I think, a mobile power station with some solar panels and the antenna and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, I don't think I'm going to have to move around too much with the rover, so that doesn't need to be super, needs to be able to move, a bit like in the tunnel with that collector thing that I just built. It needs to be able to move, but it doesn't actually... It's not going to do it that often, so I could make it, yeah, sort of less... a bit more difficult to do. Just having to zigzag up here a bit. I mean, we have got quite a load on, of course. Let's not forget that. I think... I th think... That button is power. 
on the oh, sorry strength rather than power but I think we're just about up here anyway so it's fine sure we'll make it yeah and a little drone so I'll start off with the drone work from there so it's going to be a, um, a little base for the drone a little mobile base for the drone essentially uh, and that way we can get that to Mars hopefully and just see see how things go uh, if we get that finished by the time that the gateway actually arrives I think uh, that'll be good we can pretty much send it off straight away I don't want to send it until the gateway arrives Yeah, so we have to do some stuff with the gateway, get it into its position. Oh yes, we're up the hill, we're up the hill. Just give it a little bit more speed to hopefully get some more speed up to get over these bumps and things. Oh, this is, I mean, I've just so enjoyed this uh, scenario so far in the series, it's just... You know, it hasn't been big, it's just been an engineering challenge. And yet there are just nice little things in there, which, I'm, and I mean, I kind of planned it that way, but I also didn't plan it that way. Like, for instance, um, getting from the mine to the lake, you have to go up that little gully there, and it's, you know, it's not, it, it's just, it's a little bit of a challenge, you know, and creates a bit of interest to actually go from point A to point B. But also, it's not completely daunting or boring or slow, you know, it just it just makes it worth it, you know, doing stuff like this. You know, instead of building a ship and just flying over in 5 or 10 minutes, actually, it's a nice little short enough trek that it makes it worth sticking with a rover. Bit of a challenge where it's not sort of boring. And uh, yeah, it just, it just ticks the boxes. And that's just a fluke. I didn't know that this track was here. You know, and now that I've got used to it, it's uh, it's a good little track. And it's also, it's a track, you know? You, you sort of Roman road type stuff, you know? To get from point A to point B. You need to follow, you know, you just can't go in any old direction. You, you do pretty much need to follow, follow the road map as it was. So yeah, it's worked out real well. Okay, I think I'll just get over this rise and I'll quickly jump into the wheels and just see if we can... Okay, the power's at max, so that's not going to be helpful. Hmm, okay. So, we're just heavy. <laughs> that's, that's how it is. Never mind, it would be good if I could see a bit better, but anyway. Don't think the spotlights can go any higher. Oh, they can. It might help. Let's try and get a little bit of speed. Yeah, it's not exactly a light, light load that I've got on board. Not. <laughs> It's not as heavy as that load I took on uh, Ares at War uh, yesterday, uh, which trying to get off from the surface of Lazuno 1.2 G, and I had uh, plus other things, a million, <laughs> a million uh, iron ingots, so that was quite heavy, plus all the other iron ingots that I also had that was probably added up to another hundred thousand. Uh, and plus all the components I had on board, <laughs> and plus the actual ship itself. <laughs> yeah, it, it got off the ground just. Yeah. And if you haven't seen the last stream, uh, I made a cool little a third variant of my helicopterian ship a little bit quick here and just slow down a little bit uh, a third variant of it an even smaller one and it's so cool that's real cool 
just it just fits in with that scenario. So anyway, I'm just waffling on a bit because we're almost back to the base. What is it? Four and a bit Ks. And we'll get all this processing. I'll just set the ejector to eject. Park it over the thing again. Because I don't actually have anywhere to plug it in and charge it. So that's a thing. Should probably sort that out at some point. Not that it comes back here that often. But yeah, it probably would be good to have somewhere to charge it up. So we're just about there, so I just have to go up on this ridge up here and sort of we go around, it's on the other side of that hill, the nickel's up the top of that hill there. It's funny, this is the way to go and it's 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 a good route, you can get most vehicles up here, no problems. It's just funny how certain other people playing this scenario uh, didn't find this track for quite a while. <laughs> like every time I'm like yeah taking the scenic route again it's not the route I went although I just lucked into actually finding this the first time so yeah but anyway we're getting there we've got the same lights on the back of the unit okay so we just sort of go up here and then around this bend and we kind of find a route down the hill I think it's over here oh no, down here because we sort of come down behind it on the diagonal down through this galley here let's just, let's just slow up through here so I'm just very gently pressing the, <laughs> the brakes and it's sort of making it clunk a bit that's fine it's on the ice that we need to go slow so we don't lose control we've come this far let's not crash we've really had it upside down once today actually it survived despite losing its drill it did sort of come out of the hole in one piece it's worst thing was when I ground that cover off. Okay, we won't have the brakes, we'll just gently go on. Try and slow down. Gentle, gentle. Just trying to slow down. There we go back safe and sound up the right way now that collector is actually really in the wrong spot because I have to back into it which is a bit annoying okay so let's just go past it like that Kind of in the right place. That's pretty good. We'll leave it there, shall we? And oh, okay. It's, it does that sometimes? So see how the wheels are still spinning on that side. So that's why I've got these in here, so I can turn off Izzy's and reset the wheels and that stops them. Yeah, so that's just a little thing. Okay, so if I put this on to throw out and collect. Perfect. Good, good, good. And it'll work through, so how much have we got? Iron 54. Try and remember that for next time. Don't think we'll be using heaps. Uh, mark this up. Okay, so that's that. Um, that's where I will pull the pin on this session.
as I say, I will just, I think, uh, just chuck it into the edits and basically trim the start and trim the end and put a title in and call it that. I won't go through and do any edits in the middle, I don't think. Um, yeah, so one and a half hours. If you've hung around that long, thanks for hanging around this long. And uh, yeah, as I say, next time, Scout Thing episode 42, was it? I think it's 42. And uh, yeah, the man in the red suit can get back and to doing stuff. And me in the blue suit will tidy up the mess afterwards. Speaking of which, I still do need to publish some of these things as well. Anyway, so uh, yeah, that's where I'll leave it. Thanks for joining me today. I won't have a wave. It won't work. But um, thanks for joining me today. Hope you've enjoyed today's episode. This little extra bonus one. And can join me again next time. Which will be probably tomorrow. Uh, and until next time. As always, stay safe out there everybody. And have a good one.